Let's talk about how to do a two PC setup with Streamlabs OBS. What you're going to do is run the broadcast signal from GoXLR, which resides on your gaming computer, over to your streaming computer to the line in so that you can use it in Streamlabs OBS. I've got your computer here, this fancy dancy streaming computer. Just has the right jacks on the back, so bear with me. Typically, the pink one is your mic input, the green one is your line input, and the black one is generally your line output. So many motherboards have this kind of surround sound setup. Some of these are for center channel and subwoofer and that kind of stuff. So refer to your own documentation. It could be the blue one is the line out, so just make sure you know which one is line in and line out. As soon as you know that, you're going to run from the line out of GoXLR, which coincidentally is green. So on the back of GoXLR, you're looking for the green jack. You plug in a TRS cable, which is a tip ring sleeve stereo 3.5 millimeter cable from the output of GoXLR to the line in on your motherboard for your streaming computer. Then you'll choose the line in from your streaming computer in OBS. So for example, on the screen here, uh, this laptop kind of doubles. It's a microphone input and a stereo line input. So I've chosen it here as microphone, but I've disabled desktop audio device, desktop audio device two, both the auxiliary devices down here and just chosen the single mic input. So for you, it would likely say line in. That's all you need to set up on your streaming computer. If you'd like your stream alerts to go back to GoXLR, again, we think that the line out is the blue one here or the black one, we're not quite sure, but you'd go from the line out, the one that you know, to the line in on GoXLR. And then you can actually set up a fader or do a mix with your stream alerts so that it can all be mixed into your broadcast stream. So you got one coming one way, getting processed and sent out via OBS and the other one going the other way. It's pretty straightforward. The one caveat is that if you get any buzzing, these cables, when they go between multiple grounded devices like your computer and your other computer and all the various plugs you have in your room, may need a ground isolator. They're about 10 bucks on Amazon. You can look up 3.5 millimeter ground isolator and you'll find them. If you get any buzz, grab a couple of those and you stick them on the ends of the two 3.5 millimeter cables that you have running back and forth between the streaming computer and the gaming PC. All right, that's it.